Hey guys, it's Lily again, and today we are going to be learning about picture poems. Now, a picture poem is when you draw a picture and your poem is about the thing you drew. So today we are going to be modeling a sloth and we are going, and it's a poem about a sloth. So I have my poem on this side and I'm just going to draw it. And sloths love to hang from tree branches, so I think I'm gonna draw like a branch and it's gonna be hanging from there. Now, please excuse my hands. I just finished a painting project and I scrubbed and scrubbed them and they are not, they, they have a lot of paint on them still because it won't come off, but okay. So let's just get started. So I think I'm gonna start with the branch. So you can just like, it's, it, you, know, you don't have to be artistic at all to do these. It's just meant for something fun to do. Cause I know you guys are probably really bored. So we have a little branch, maybe just give it like a little bit of leave action. And now we're just gonna start it. So I'm gonna read you guys this poem first. So here it goes. He hangs from a loft infested by moth and his face has no forehead or chin, but he carries this off. The lovable sloth for his rest is a hug and a grin. So now we just have to draw, draw it in the shape of a sloth. Okay, so I got the wording done and it doesn't have to be the best at all. It's just supposed to be fun and a little bit different than what normal poems are. So, and my handwriting is not great at all. So your handwriting does not have to be good to do this. I'm just gonna give him a little face because you guys can see his body and he needs a face. Okay, and I think that completes it. As you guys can see, it is super simple, and you've been being watching it drawn upside down. So I'm actually gonna show you it from this way. So obviously it does not look exactly like a sloth, and that is perfectly fine, but I just thought you guys would have a little bit of fun with it. So I'd love to see your guys's, bye.